Welcome back to the program on this Memorial Day. And to talk about Memorial Day, we have a very special guest joining us right now, Major Catherine Headley from the Iowa National Guard. Welcome, Major. Thank you. Good morning. I'm so happy to be here. Well, we just wanted to touch base with you to talk about Memorial Day and what Memorial Day is really all about. Could you tell us? Certainly. Memorial Day is um, more than just cookouts or a glorious three-day weekend or the beginning of summer. Um, the meaning of Memorial Day differs diff uh, dramatically from Veterans Day and Armed Forces Day. So Veterans Day pays tribute to every veteran who has served our great nation. Armed Forces Day recognizes those who currently serve in the military. And Memorial Day is a day of remembrance and to honor those who have sacrificed and given their lives in defense of our great nation. Wow, and I'm sure it has special meaning, especially to those that are serving uh, like yourself right now. Uh, how near and dear is it to your heart? It's very dear to my heart. I mean, remembering those who sacrificed their lives um, so that we can gather, it's just, it's, it has a special place in my heart. I also remember the and keep the families of those who sacrificed themselves in my heart because they're the ones who are carrying the burden of of their loved ones' great sacrifice. So, you know, I keep those who who died um, to give us our freedoms, and then I also remember their families as well. Now, Major, you mentioned that uh, some people just think of it as a long weekend and don't really have a grasp on what it really means. Maybe there are some people out there watching right now that say, well, I don't have any really close ties. I didn't know anybody uh, that, that passed away in the military per se. Is there still a way for them to honor those that we lost? Absolutely. I mean, you can also uh, visit cemeteries. So I know that American flags are still placed on every grave marker. Um, I know in, in Arlington National Cemetery and cemeteries across the nation. So if you just want to visit those cemeteries, that's another way to remember those um, who paid the ultimate sacrifice. Right. So I uh, know what events do we have coming up uh, that you want to talk about here this morning? Thanks for, for bringing that up. We have some great events coming to Camp Dodge from the Iowa National Guard. The one that is closest is the Camp Dodge Summer Concert Series that we will be bringing back this summer. So we have the 2021 Summer Concert Series, and that's going to be starting the week after the Johnston Green Days. So June 24th, that Thursday, we're going to have the Nadas, and it's going to continue every Thursday for four weeks with uh, the Army band, the Sidewinders. We also have Brother Trucker, and we're ending with Stand in, Standing Hampton. And we can't wait to bring this great concert series back, um, back to the, the soldiers, to the families, and to the public. Well, it, it's amazing uh, how that series has grown, and, and it's really going to be great because now we're going to be able to go back and actually uh, enjoy it in person, right? Absolutely. That's what we're hoping. We waited a little bit longer in the year to, to start the concert series. It is an outdoor event, so we hope that people will social distance and enjoy food, family, friendship, and great music. That's awesome. Now, tell everybody where this is happening at. You mentioned uh, Camp Dodge, but uh, specifically the area where this is, because this is kind of a neat story, too. It is. So it'll be at the historic pool pavilion, which I know a lot of Iowans are familiar with, with when they had the pool on Camp Dodge. And that's been uh, turned into a great outdoor venue uh, with concession stands and a pavilion and just a huge grassy green area to just enjoy uh, the outdoors. Well, Major Catherine Headley, uh, we just want to say thank you for your service and please thank everyone that is around you as well and we will be remembering those that we lost on this memorial day thank you so much for your time thank you thank you for having me and thank you for your support all right there you have it folks uh, one of the things that we need to remember here today so from all of us here at iowa i want to remind you to remember those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice in the line of military duty on this memorial day